from it. Do you need anybody? So we're gonna do C fret, major, which is not the like a B, but on the fourth fret. Mm -hmm. And then the F. Let's just do that. Do you need the C? C major F. I need somebody to love. We're just gonna do two lines, okay? Over and over, right, Phoenix? Then we'll take a break. How many times? Until we become proficient. That means a hundred. <laughs> All right. Give me a hundred, boy. A <laughs> hundred push-ups. All right. Okay. Flex your fingers a little bit. Flex. 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 I don't know. You're getting the. the <laughs> feel it. Okay. Starting the fourth fret. If you're trying to get the feel of it yet, get the feel of it. Mm -hmm. Why don't you sing it together too so you do you need anybody? I need somebody to love. Again, we just have to match it with the song. Okay, start. Do you need somebody? I want somebody to love. Can it be anybody? I just want someone to love. And that's the speed right there. That's the hard part. That it's got to go at that speed. So look at this. Look at this, Phoenix. This is where. Need anybody? I want somebody to love. Can it be anybody? I just want someone to love. Right? You want to take a break? Okay. What do you figure about? I figure I'll get the hang of my fingers first. <laughs> do you one two three four here? Do you? Now remember, we're skipping a fret. Right. We're skipping a fret, and there you go, like that. There you go. Do you? Need... Hey, Phoenix, look at this. See? Do you need anybody? Somebody's gonna change to E D. To D. Somebody to love. There you go. And we'll go back to that fourth one. Can it be anybody? One, two, three, four. For me too. <laughs> it is. <laughs> no, Next because, time I'll sit no, there. I have then. to. I, I, you see this? I have to. Take I'm okay with the D, C, D, and E, but when it comes to this, yeah, it's like I really have to. I well, guess, all you gotta do to make it easier for yourself uh -huh. is tilt the guitar up. Like this? Oh, like this? Yes. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> all you have to do, and then it makes it easier. That's the professional. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> He's like a JT, he does this, right, JT? Up. And then you might want to tilt it a little bit back down when you hit that F. You can just move your body. Your body can move the guitar. Ah. See, now we're like a rock singer now here. Uh, <laughs> you notice that they do that a lot? They'll go like oh, that yeah, and they'll go like that? that? It's because, well, one is for show. show. One is for show, uh -huh. but it does make it easier to hit that chord. And then, so, kind of, it's for show. Uh -huh. It turned into for show, but it started off as making it easier for the musician to do it. Okay. And then people would see that and they would think that they were doing it on purpose, like to just be show off. But they weren't, they were doing it to make the chord easier. But then when they see me do that, the fans would go like, yeah. And then they'd go like, oh shoot, every time I do that, everyone thinks it's cool. And You're lucky, it, Phoenix. At your age, show. I never had a guitar that, I mean, my sister had a guitar, but I didn't have formal lessons. So I was just playing with my badminton racket. Like a virtual rock and roll. Yeah, yeah, but that's not going to get you nowhere. <laughs> exactly. It seems so easy to just doing this, this. Yeah, but, but there's a lot to it when it really comes to play. Exactly. And I'll tell you, and I'll tell you one thing. He's doing really good because he does know the chords. Uh -huh. You know, it's just about practicing now. True. It's just about practicing now.